So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys I'm going to showcase to you how you can get this amazing weapon and armor set, a pretty rare one. I haven't seen many people actually post about these, especially as a full set in one video, so today we're getting to it all. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leave a like, it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the Rotten Jewelry set, the Rotten Jewelry's armor set, as well as two amazing Rotten weapons. These are actually uh, obtained from three different enemies, guaranteed drops upon the first kill of said enemy, so no silver scarab needed here. Um, they drop all from enemies within these snowy lands, the mountain tops, the giants, and the hidden path to the Haddock tree. That's where you need to come to. But before I show you the location of these, let me quickly check and showcase to you guys the weapons and armor themselves. So, the armor uh, comes in three parts a helm, a cloak, and as well as the greaves. Now, what's special about these is they act a lot like this talisman right here. The ship is whoa, constantly attracts enemies' aggression. Now, if we look at the actual armor piece, you can see the wearer becomes slightly easy target for foes. Isn't on the cloak, but is on the legs. But hey, amazing looking as you can see. Now the weapons themselves are pretty badass. The Great Axe is cool too, scales with uh, strength and dexterity, not bad at all for Great Axe. Um, a colossal weapon that is. Requires 30 strength and 10 dexterity and causes a scarlet up build up of 65. The actual hammer. It requires 26 in strength and 8 in dexterity, so it causes the scarlet up build up of 65. Not bad whatsoever. These you can both apply those ashes of war to make them even more unique than what they are. So, pretty cool, guys. Pretty cool. I haven't scaled them up, I haven't leveled them up myself to test them out. Ain't my kind of thing, but I know there are four people out there. 100%. Okay, so the cloak as well, which I should actually uh, showcase here. Is you can alter it to take away the cloak and have just amazing looking snakes wrapped around your arms and if you don't like them guys you can all shoot back we all know this so as you can see it will cost you 500 runes it does make it a lot lighter but also takes away some of the damage negation and resistance so here we can see guys here we can see i like it this way as well because you can see the helm much much better so if we take a closer look at the helm you can see all those snakes popping off it pretty badass there's also snakes wrapped around the gauntlets too as you can see amazing guys absolutely amazing so this if it's interesting to you this is how you get them okay so these come from three different enemies repeat up on here so you need to come to this area here the hidden path to the halley tree now to get up here guys you probably already know but for those that don't you need the halley tree medallion one comes from commander Nile, boss uh, castle so located around there uh, kill him he gives you one half the other half is much easier to get you need to come down here this grace point right here guys you'll come up this hill and you'll come here then you need to come i think it's this way i'm not exactly sure but there's a guy in a basket punch the basket clear his dialogue he gives you the other half plenty of guys on the halleck tree medallion guys just search youtube for them and then you're good you have the halleck tree medallion you can come back up to the grand lift of the world and then guys you can press the left or right in the d-pad and come up to here so from here guys like i said there's three enemies first time drops guaranteed one kill each easy so the first one is located around here i'll show you where each one is on screen either way um, but yes this one drops you the helmet and the axes or no sorry he drops you the helmet and the hammer another one is located within this cave right here unfortunately i lost my footage for this one my hard drive corrupted my actual backup hard drive corrupted i lost about three or four terabytes worth of Ring recordings so i haven't actually got the recording of me killing the boss but hey i'll show you how to get to this cave and um, it is a bit foggy so yes once you get here guys run straight through it kill the boss you get the cloak you don't get a weapon from this boss you just get the cloak the one we just altered and the third and final enemy is located about there so you need to come to either this grace point which is probably better and literally just run to him and kill him he gives you the axe and the i think the legs yes he gives you the legs and the axe the guy here gives you the helmet and the hammer and this guy gives you the cloak and well guys it really is that simple that's how you get this amazing kind of rare armor set haven't seen like i said anyone showcase it all in one video so yes pretty unique pretty amazing looking for sure and well guys there we have it now on screen now you'll see the locations to each enemy like i said the catacombs one you'll have to run through it 
and kill the boss. I haven't got that footage, unfortunately, but I can still show you where that, that catacombs is located. The other two I have footage of, so check that out on screen now, guys. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, it really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more out of ring, be sure to subscribe and hopefully my be beautiful people. I will see you on that next one.